What's up, YouTube? Capital G here. Got a nice little YGO Pro replay for you guys. And this is Penguins versus Red Resonators. And yes, you did not mishear me. I said freaking Penguins. Uh, we got those Penguins out here. And what's cool about this is he's actually as terrible as this looks where he's running Bolt Penguin in the main deck in 2016. Lol. He's actually running some meta cards. So you can see we got the Solemn here. We got the Call of the Haunted. I mean, Rodent Toad is pretty good because it can make Tree Toad. I mean, that's like its best use probably in the game right now and he's playing against um red resonators i think this deck is legitimate uh so let's see exactly what's going to happen here it's not a cheap deck unfortunately red resonators is like actually just because of the extra deck so he activates resonator call goes into red resonator special summons that red wolf the attack gets cut but who cares because he's just going to synchro in the scarlight then he's going to synchro into hot red dragon archery and abyss this card in my opinion is so good i wish there was an easier way to make it uh because it it basically can protect itself for the most part it can negate anything that's face up on the field it can negate your opponent's spells and traps their monsters uh if you had like a solemn to back this up or like a vanities it would be an extremely good opening like if you have a vanities plus it's like pretty much gg against most people's decks like if they try and twin twister the vanities you just negate the twin twister all right but the one thing that this card can't do its worst nightmare is cards that activate in the damage step get wrecked by that nightmare penguin oh my god this is this this will like literally put me on tilt mode if i summoned a hot red dragon archfiend abyss and it got taken out by a fucking nightmare penguin i'd be like what is this nonsense so it gets spun back to the extra deck because it can't negate activation so it can't be used during the damage step he tries to go into clear wing but that gets hit with solomon now he's basically getting wrecked i like how he has that normal summon of bolt penguin <laughs> And then he's going to go into Dante, everyone's everyone's favorite friend who didn't get limited. He's going to go ahead and attack. And uh, this player, the Red Resonator player, he's forced to play uh, one day apiece. Which, anytime you play one day apiece and you're not playing a degenerative FTK deck, you're probably in a shitty position. So... He does that. Uh, top deck's another Bolt Penguin, but now he's able to special summon Swap Frog, get the Rodent Toad in, and now he summons Tree Toad, and it's like, wow. Uh, this duel's looking like a complete blowout, and probably the side you didn't expect. He's going to go for Norden off Instant Fusion, but nah, dog, that's not going to happen. He's just going to negate the Norden effect, and now he's going to take your Norden. He puts the Tree Toad back in the extra. I don't think I would have, I think I would have taken a monster, to be honest. But he goes into Charge Warrior, but he's not done yet. He actually is going to summon Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon, which is pretty impressive, but he can't attack, or at least he doesn't attack, so I don't really know what that was about. But he's actually uh, going to lose here, because Call of Haunted is flipped over. He gets the, uh, what's it called? He flips over uh, Norton, and actually, let me pause here. What was that material? I think that material was Flying Penguin. So, this guy literally lost to a Flying Penguin and a Bolt Penguin and a Nightmare Penguin. Like, this is legit. You guys can't tell me this is like a hot. This is actually Penguins. Like, this guy's even running no Penguin. Like, what, are you serious? <laughs> that art always gets <laughs> no Penguin. <laughs> and he's going to lose her because uh, Utopia, like, you know, 5,000 attack and whatnot. Then Dante coming through with uh, 2,500 on top of that. And he still had a Twin Twister. I don't really think that that was good because this guy had a dead Twin Twister in his hand. So Twin Twister wasn't doing really anything for either player. But um, a dominating victory, Penguins over red resonators i definitely wouldn't have thought that if you would have told me to bet my money on a deck i would have thought that it would have been a complete blowout but the good thing about penguins is if there is one redeeming quality they do work well with the frog engine and like i think water is just going to be a very strong attribute moving forward because of tree toad you know being able to go into bahamut shark using like these random level fours pretty strong and then being able to just summon treat toad off of like level twos the frog engine is pretty good too and plus you can make a best dweller it can be a little more powerful than usual plus the rank four toolbox is just super strong so let me know what you guys think hopefully you enjoyed this match i try and just you know upload things that are not always like meta and i found this match and it was it was pretty interesting you don't get to see penguins every day subscribe if you haven't thumbs up the video if you guys enjoyed it thank you for watching as always